Dragon Ball Legends has been giving us unique equipments for sparking units to hopefully bring them back in the meta and part 3 of the 5th year anniversary is no different. So this time they've given us a unique equipment for the sparking Zenkai Awakened Yellow Goku Black. So this unique equipment does look absolutely unbelievable and possibly one of the best in the game. So I'm interested to see if it really does make this Goku Black come back into the meta or not. So without further ado, let's have a look at the equipment and the team and jump in some rank PvP. Let's go. Okay, so here is the equipment and I spent so much resources, including like 500 slot removers, over a thousand energy, amongst other things to get this to a Z+. Plus. So it did take quite a while. Make sure to stay throughout the video and we'll see if it was worth it or not. So slot one gives strike defense and blast defense up to 50%. Then base health up to 15. Then we got sustained damage cut up to 15% as well. Slot two is strike attack and blast attack up to 50%. Inflict damage up to 30% and then key recovery up to 50. And then he also gets up to 10% damage inflicted against Saiyan or hybrid Saiyans, which obviously there's a lot of them running around with future and things and then slot three which i have got a red slot so the max slot is applies the following effects itself when the character uses special arts draws a blast arts card next plus 60 percent to damage inflicted cannot be cancelled activates once he gets extra card draw speed by one level cannot be cancelled activates once and then minus 23 to blast arts cost which is actually quite a lot Obviously, if you haven't got the red slot, it just gets a little bit worse from there, so you can read that if you want to. So this is the equipment, and I would say this equipment, if it went on, say, Ultra VB, it would break the game. This is probably the, one of the best equipments you can get in Dragon Ball Legends at the moment. So we're going to be jumping into rank PvP, obviously using a future setup. So the main units we're going to be jumping in with is the Zenkai Sword of Hope Trunks because I just wanted to use him. And then we've obviously got the Goku Black with his unique equipment. And then we've got Ultra VB as well to kind of clean up if we need to with the Goku Black. Because unfortunately with these sparking unique equipments that I've experienced recently, it does well to make them a lot better but doesn't quite make them competitive in the meta. Not in these higher ranks at the very least. So we'll see what we can do anyway. We got a Zenkai buff for the Trunks and the VB, and then we got a health buff for the Mai. I would have liked another Zenkai buff for the Goku Black, but unfortunately, there's not really another Yellow Future slash Saiyan um, Zenkai buff that fits on this team, unfortunately. So he, he is just getting Zenkai buff one time in, on this team. So it's be interesting to see how he does. Make sure to let me know down below which one you think or which unique equipment for sparking units you think is the best that they've released so far. And if you haven't already, make sure to hit that like and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get into it. Let's go. Okay, looks like we're going to go up against a future squad ourselves. Okay, let's start off with the Goku Black. And the free-to-play Goku Black looks like he's going to be the only main issue for him. And Rosé, of course, but uh, we'll see what we can do. Let's get into it. Okay, so starting off with Rosé, I'll try my best to make sure that VB doesn't uh, take over the showcase. But whilst I want to show off the Goku Black, I also want to win, basically. Nice. We can count, start our combo then, so let's do that. Um, short, there's Trunks. You know what? Let's do this, because what are you going to do? Go into the free-to-play Goku Black? A uh, bit of lag here. That's not ideal. Right, okay. Nice, 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 nice. That gets re rid of our key. We'll pop this straight away. Uh, no key, unfortunately. Okay, we've got a counter, so if we need to, we can use that. So let's back up a little bit. Uh, I mean... Ah, no. Uh, this is going to hurt. Actually, that's not bad from BB. I'll take that. Right, we'll start building up our gauge. Uh, okay. We can reduce the key in a little bit. I don't really want to switch with Goku Black. Unless he uses that blue card. There we go. Let's switch into him and see how much he can tank this for. Eh, it's not bad. We'll draw an extra blast card with this. Let's go for quick attack. And do that. Okay. Let's blue card it then. That's not a lot of damage against a free-to-play unit. 
uh, what's happening here. Right, thankfully he did that because um, it wouldn't let me do anything. Right, double sidestep worked out for us. I'm imagining Trunks is going to come in soon, but that's fine. There he is. Let's go into the Goku Black, see if he can do anything. That is not very good damage at all. Um, we're going to rise in with him. Uh, let's go with a strike. I should have gone with blue, actually. It's not long since I used one, but we kind of need all the damage. Good. Okay, so the free-to-play Goku Black is gone. I mean, that's one down, I guess. His damage isn't crazy, unfortunately. Even though the uh, equipment is nuts, his damage is not, definitely not nuts. Nice, 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 nice. I will take that. Um, he doesn't go into Rosé, so I'm going to switch into you. Let's just start building you up a little bit. Um, actually, I'm going to pop this. Let's do that. And can he finish off Trunks? He goes into Rosé. I think we're going to finish off Rosé here. Let's see. Let's make sure that we get our taps in and all that. Um, okay. I mean, granted VB is the main damage dealer here, but we are sort of showing off the Goku Black a little bit. Nice. And we can get an extra card there. Can't there, unfortunately. Okay, I'm going to pop this. Nice. Okay, we've got lots of blasts, so we don't have to worry too much. And we've got another Rising Rush as well because of uh, VB. Right, we should nullify Endurance with this and get rid of Trunks, who was probably the second most um, biggest pain for us. Let's go into VB here. And Rising. Nice, okay, we got a forfeit. Like I said, VB and Trunks were kind of doing most of the work. Goku Black didn't seem to look like he put out a lot of damage. But he did a little bit in this one, so I'll definitely take it. Let's jump into another one. Okay, up next we got another Future Squad. Once again with VB. It's quite unfortunate that Goku Black is a yellow unit, but we will see. Hopefully we get the dub, let's go. Okay, starting off with Rose, Goku Black. Let's see what we can do. Um, okay, I'm going to do this. Get rid of your Vanish. And we will just pop off for a little bit. And he brings Trunks in straight away. Not too much of a bad idea, but... We're just going to make sure that we get to that failed gauge from him. So we don't have to worry about... Basically, the key reduction. And go into you. I'm going to do this because we do need that for all damage. Ah, oh, no. That's going to hurt. So at least he's got all his buffs now. And we'll do this. We'll match that. And there you go. It's got no blast cover change. So we'll do this. Fantastic. We're going to go into BB and rise in. He's leaving him in. Let's go with a blast, I guess. You watch him pick it because it's blast or strike. Yep, there you go. Thing is, you don't want to go with strike too much with VB because he gets one in his hand. Okay, fantastic. Uh, we have not got anywhere near a full gauge. I thought we did. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, we're going to have to go into you. Is he going to die? Like I said, I want to show off the Goku Black, but I also want to win. He's not. He tanked that pretty well, actually. I'll take that from him. Um, okay, good. We've got a couple of blasts as well. That damage is not really uh, fantastic there, I'm not going to lie. Let's go into VB here just to do a bit of damage. Um, we get our cover null again there. 
Okie dokie. You know what? Is it worth popping this? Probably. See what we can do. He's leaving trunks in. Come on, VB. I, I don't... I, mm. I feel like this is a bit of a misplay, but we'll get as much damage as we can with all the taps. Yeah, definitely a misplay there. Let's go into trunks here. Uh, okay, interesting rush there. Thank you for that. Yep, definitely switching. Nope, we'll stop you there. We're bringing in our Goku Black. Okay, you have no vanish. Let's use a blue card. Okay, he took out Rosé. I press the green card. Hello. <laughs> okay. Um, let's go into you. We'll also get a full gauge now. So you got no key. I'm going to pop mine as well. And uh, nope. See you later. Let's do this, and we may as well use this. There we go. Trunks is gone. Okay. I mean, Goku Black did something. Got rid of Ultra Rose. That's pretty quite a big feat. Let's get a brand new hand here. Okay, good, 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 good. Right, let's go into VB because we want to make sure that we get the dub here. We do have the Rise and Rush as well. Hello? Oh, okay, he's forfeiting. Fair enough, he knew that he was going to lose. But, okay, VB finished it off again. But Goku Black took out Ultra Rose, Goku Black. So, therefore, he's better than him. Nice. Let's go into another one. Okay, up against a fusionish squad. Uh, they're all being Zenkai buffed. You can tell that they're bringing in three Ultras, and they're quite high stars as well. So, hopefully, we can do something in this one. I guess we'll start off with Goku Black. This may be the one that we lose. We'll see. But, hey-ho, it is what it is. Okay, we're starting off with uh, type advantage. But I don't think it really matters with the Goku Black. I do think somewhat. It feels like you are um, starting off with one less person. Because um, Goku Black is not really fantastic. I mean, sure. We're going to just build up our Vegito here. Just a little bit. Nice. Um, even though we're not doing too much damage. Yeah. I mean, it's chip damage at least. Let's bring in the Goku Black again. Okay, he brings in Gogeta. Fantastic. I mean, okay, we've got a green card as well, so we'll use that. Is he going full screen? No, he's not. Um, let's pop this as well. Okay, he's going for a tackle. Nice. And we'll use that blast there. Um, you know what? I might as well just do it. This may hurt. Yep, it's going to hurt. Got rid of our rush as well. Nice, okay, okay. Um, sure. You know what? I'm going to rise in just straight away. Get someone out of here. Um, let's go with a blue card. We don't need the damage. And if you've watched any of my videos, you you know that I absolutely hate picking Strike or Blast. Because I always seem to get picked. But, alright, Super Gogeta is gone. That's a big win for us. And we've restored our gauge as well. Um... I press the green card now. Um, okay, we'll go into trunks for this. Start building up his gauge a little bit. Okay. And he goes straight away there. Interesting. Interesting manoeuvre. Okay, well, there goes all your key. Yep. Okay, we both tackle. <laughs> really? You're going to rush Goku Black? Uh, let's go with a blue card, shall we? 
No, it's a strike. Okay, well, the showcase unit's uh, defeated, but at least he did something in this one. He got rid of the other guy's rush. I mean, that's a win, I guess. Why? I don't know. Okay, we're going to do this. Let me guess, VB coming in? I mean, you're going to have to, because otherwise Gogeta's gone, really, isn't he? He doesn't. Is he gone? He's not. Uh, tap a quick attack. Yeah, there you go. Okay, he's dead. Fantastic. Um, okay. Let's just do this with Trunks. He is charge stepping very weirdly. I mean, it's working for him, I guess. He's probably got a rise and rush, actually. Actually, just literally just use one. Surely you haven't got one. And you didn't use it with VB, so you didn't get that extra card. Uh, or extra Dragon Ball, even. Okay. I don't know if this is going to kill Trunks. Uh, we tried it in the last fight, actually. And it didn't do anywhere near as, damage, as much damage as I was hoping. So let's see. No, it's not. Um, I'm going to do this. Okay, he's just going for a super there. I don't know what you're doing there. I'm going to pop this. Let's do that. And Trunks is going to finish him off. At least we get the LF off. He stayed for it. But uh, Goku Black didn't really do anything in this one. I mean, he got rid of the Rising Rush, I guess you can call it. But whilst we're watching this uh, beautiful LF, which I haven't seen for a little while, to be fair... Um, I'll go over, I'll do my outro basically, we'll leave it there, the Goku Black, it, when he first came out, wasn't a very good unit to be honest, when he got his Zenkai, wasn't a very good unit to be honest, and now he has got, I do think this unique equipment is probably the best unique equipment, or one of the strongest ones in the game, and he's still not quite there, is he? Uh, I mean, especially because we've gone against a, quite a number of uh, top tier units in this one. Um, I mean, in that one alone, there was a lot of like 14 star ultras. Uh, the VB was like 12 star. The Gogeta was like 14 stars. Um, and even though the Goku Black that I've got is 14 stars and he's got one of the most broken equipment, he wasn't doing a lot of damage, to be honest. Like I said at the start of fight, it was just a bit like you're starting off with two characters rather than three. I mean, you just get an extra vanish with one of them, I guess. The thing is with these unique equipments, they're really good, and they do bring these units up like just below the meta, in my personal opinion. So, for instance, if you're in the lower ranks, probably look quite good when you're going up against low star units and things like that, especially if they're 14 stars. But in these higher ranks or against any decent teams, they don't just don't seem to perform. I mean, he's got a lot of help with this equipment, and we've managed to get it a Z plus with the red slot at the end. So he's getting all that damage inflicted, up to 60% just from using his green card, and everything else as well. And he just wasn't really doing it for me, to be honest. Wasn't doing a lot of damage. So he's had everything he possibly can. He obviously was released, got a Zenkai, now he's got this equipment, and he's still just not really fantastic, in my personal opinion. I mean, he can be handy in some situations, I guess, but... He's not the... It, I, I don't know. I just don't rate it. If I was you and you were thinking, should I uh, grind out for this equipment? Because it took me ages. took me like over... Se took me over a thousand energy to do this. And like 400, 500 slot removers. Everything. I'd personally say save your resources, to be honest. But let me know your thoughts down below. And if you haven't already, make sure to hit that like and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching. Until next time, I'll catch you later. Ciao.